Hi, this is Catherine Rosen with Board Game Geek TV. I'm sitting here with Victor Kubelke from Eggerspiele, and he's here to talk about Porta Nigra. Exactly. It's a beautiful board with yeah. all these gorgeous little towers. Yeah, that's the best thing about the game, <laughs> but not just the only. There are no, a no, few no. great things about it. So Porta Nigra is, uh, is a black gate in, in English. Mm -hmm. um, it's, a, it's a building in Trier, which is a city in Germany, and it was built by the Romans. Mm -hmm. And uh, in this game, we built a few buildings in this time, um, the Porta Nigra and uh, the city wall um, and an uh, amphitheater. And we do that using cards, just uh, every player has cards, there are actions on them, and I have always two in my hand, and when I, it's my turn, I play one, and I can do as many actions as these. Oh, it's a little, little these, uh... Oh, what is it called? Uh, oh, chariots, my... no. No, no, it's, no. It's, I don't, oh, I don't I'm know so that sorry. I'm, I'm so barrier. sorry too. <laughs> <laughs> I know it in German. It's Fackel. <laughs> yeah, Fackel. Thank you. That was in Norwegian as well. Uh, yeah, I can't remember Whatever. English. But, but you know, this is the fire thingies. <laughs> let's, let's call them them. And, sorry. and you, you have different actions on them and you can do two of them. Yeah. So, uh, and uh, when you do that, so you can buy bricks like this. This black one means mm -hmm. you can buy the brick. Uh, everybody has this player board. This is the cost. So if I buy black brick from here, I put it there and pay one for it. Okay. So and, and then it's placed there, and um, with this one I can buy it from any. So I could use this one and this one to buy two black and place them there. So these are from now on black because uh, you see they are actually grey, but uh, they are uh, five different colors, uh, and these spots you can build in these using your um, your the master builders. Yes. Let's call them. So you move them to this place with a building action. This would be something like this, for example. And you would use these two black bricks to, let's do it right to there. To place on the black area yeah. there. So you need two black bricks to place there. Then you have to put one of your meeples on that. And, and then, now you build. And, and you get these points. And um, this way you build the buildings up. Uh, the Porta Negra is special. There you can go up to eight oh, wow. stores. So it's uh, very rewarding because the the higher you go, the more. The higher you go, again. the more, and um, the white ones are the most. You know, so if you have eight to forty points, so this is the way you get, get, gather the points. And uh, there's a lot going on. You have some majority uh, scorings in the game, and uh, you get some bonus if you reach certain heights and, and everything. And the great thing is that you build up a city that is 3D. And it's yeah, you get at the end of the game, at the, the at the end of the game, you have a really beautiful board and. We don't even want to take it down. <laughs> Would love to put it somewhere, buy a new game. I think that's a good idea. Everybody buy every yeah, time a new game. <laughs> Build it you up, buy a new copy it every time you're going to play it. I think that would be great. We would be very thankful for you that. You still have your house pretty quick, though. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> so uh, it's about it's for two to four players and um, about 60 to 90 minutes. 60 to 90, so an hour, yeah. an hour and a half. Exactly. Great. So. Thank you very much. It's yeah, a gorgeous welcome. game. Uh, designer? Is uh, Wolfgang Kramer and Michael Kiesling. Great. Thank you so much. That is Porta Negra from Eckhart Spieler. Beautiful.